What's going on guys, it's Shu here bringing you another review slash reaction on Ed and Zero. This chapter, I gotta say, left me with a bit of a surprise towards the end. I was not expecting this new character. But then again, man, Mashima gives us all these kinds of twists and turns. Just when things seem to be pretty motivational and like everyone was just having a good resolution. Everyone was surprised to see this. Specifically, Holy and Elsie. But before I get to you guys, please make sure if you have not already, I would appreciate it tremendously if you guys could take the minute to go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and make sure to watch the entire video. That would help out tremendously. I would appreciate you guys so much. But let's get into it. So, we start off with a bit of Xiaomi, who we hadn't seen in quite some time. She actually gives us a recap of what had happened, which is kind of her thing at this point. We, we know that when we see her, all she likes to do is to recap information in a way that we, well, I guess, like. She basically just kind of shows up and says that during the three years, uh, we had Ziggy taking over and all these cosmos is the goal and... And we have how the Ed and Zero crew have basically been freeing these planets after Ziki has taken control of them. So that is what they have been doing this during this whole entire time. But now the attack on Ziggy is much closer than they like than ever. And so we actually have the crew getting ready, all of them having this serious face. We actually see every member of the crew actually getting a little bit of like i guess you could say screen time if that makes sense but we all see them and they're all serious everyone is ready to go into battle went against ziggy and even having a little bit of scheming going on but i'll get to that in a second we actually show a little bit of what's going on with rebecca she's still bothered by the fact that she feels responsible for the chronophage showing up to planet norma back way back in the beginning but in reality we have to realize or she has to realize that that had to be an event that had to happen and it was not her fault necessarily but it was something that had to happen in order for them to escape and they were able to save wise before this actually happened so in the end, even though it seems bad, it really wasn't. It's not like the people are dead, they're still there, they're just looping after every 50 years, and they'll never know the difference. And here, we actually have, where they're not trying to kill Ziggy, they're actually trying to use the chronophage to loop them around and not leave the planet. So, I mean, that's kind of a benevolent thing to do, I guess, for, for Ziggy, despite everything he's done. But we have Elsie, who wants to take out ziggy that is something that she has said that she wants to take him out and and she even says you know that that's her goal and we actually have the her group just kind of like you know it's crazy how we're pirates and we're trying to save the world but it's like it's for a noble cause at this point you know that is why they're doing this but we also have uh, some of holy's i guess you would say people holy's uh, subjects or holy's uh, subordinates checking in with her and saying are you really going to be giving us orders from the ed and zero what are they gonna think what are the rest of the guys gonna think when you're there it's like well feather already knows it's only a matter of time before justice knows and anyone else from that group and so she's like but in time and they even say right he 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 we actually start hearing them laughing about a plan that they're going to have so we know that the betrayal is coming it's just once the goal is achieved they will then betray them so we'll see but then like i said things get very hairy they start the attack and they see a bunch of dragons but the crazier part is that we see this new character named god magnolia i think that's her name she is the mother of the dragons and elsie and uh, holy were very surprised so this is actually a very interesting twist but i'd love to know what you guys think let me know what you guys think about this twist as always though stay safe and i'll catch you later